Other news today, colorful crowds packed Columbus and its businesses today as it celebrated Pride Weekend. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jamie Ostroff and for Audrey Hassan tonight. Business owners say Pride falls in the top five busiest weekends of the year. NBC4's Anna Hoffman is here tonight in the newsroom with how this booming business weekend helps us kick off the summer. Jamie, business owners tell me in Columbus that they're having, they're so happy to have Pride Weekend back in full swing after two years. It feels like a rebirth, and this profitable weekend is exactly what they need. This is our busiest weekend, no doubt. Aaron Aranda, the bar manager at the South Bend Tavern, says on Pride Weekend, sales typically increase by about 50%. Last night was a huge night for us, and then today has already started. It's, it's incredible, not even 5 p.m., and um, we have a great crowd. We're really happy. He says this year's Pride celebration already feels bigger than in 2019, both economically and spiritually. Kind of a, a rebirth of Pride here in Columbus, and it seems like downtown was busier than ever, so we're extremely happy about that. Aranda says the people that come on Pride normally continue to come back and spend money throughout the summer. The South Bend is one of dozens of LGBTQ owned businesses in Columbus. Just around the corner is another, Kevin's Irish Pub. Bartender Megan Dunn says Pride Weekend is no ordinary weekend. It is our bread and butter. Dunn says Friday night sales doubled a normal Friday night, bringing in people from all colors of the rainbow. I'm going to say it's probably going to be busier this year because more people are ready to just come back out. No pun intended. <laughs> These businesses say the spike in sales doesn't just help the business, but it also helps out the workers by going right back into the community and showing a little bit of extra love for the LGBTQ community in Columbus. Jamie. Thanks, Anna. And we know it's been a tough couple of years for those workers as well.